Hey, this episode marks our one year anniversary of Steam Culture, so I'm glad you're here to help us celebrate. Stay tuned, we're gonna look back at all we've done in one year. Okay, so the point of when we started Steam Culture was that we wanted to highlight where Steam and our culture had intersected, whether it was historical, whether it was in the movies, Steam has influenced and just been kind of woven into our culture. And that's what we've tried to highlight for a year. So I hope we've done that. And we've tried to do that with kind of two things. We've tried to be informative and we've tried to be entertaining. So we want to look back at that. Now, most of the entertainment is kind of a low IQ, which happens to be my specialty. So let's look back on some low IQ humor. Hola, everyone. Surprise, it's Brent. I'll see you next week on Steam Culture. Yes, the French baguette. Hey, today's steam culture is going to be out of this world. Three, two, one. Boilermaker, so stay tuned. Hey, Ricky, run the steam round. Oh. Well, we sure did have a lot of fun, but hopefully we were also informative. Found out the formula was 33,000 foot-pounds of work per minute. Now, high-pressure steam is sent down that steam well, and as it comes out and hits the rock, it starts to work through all the fissures and cracks. Well, one thing you need to know about water is it contains oxygen, which is awesome if you're a fish. It's not great if you're metal. How did people take showers and baths before Rood invented this kind of water heater? Well, it turns out there was a little something that's part of our history called the Saturday bath. So with that in mind, I hope you found the episodes to be entertaining and knowledgeable. And I need to thank some people. I need to thank you all for watching because if you're not watching there's no episodes to produce so I'm glad you're here with us every Friday I want to thank the internet for being such a great source of reliable information week in and week out I want to thank Tyler who's our cameraman and producer and you guys never need to get to see Tyler so I'm gonna show him to you right now here he is say hi Tyler and that picture should be showing up right now well to close I just think this is really neat it. Steam is so powerful and it's completely naturally occurring. We didn't do anything. Fire and water, these are natural elements and they used to create all that power and steam and man's job is to harness it and we have done an excellent job of that. So good job to all those smart people out there who bring us this great content for Steam Culture. Well thanks for joining me this week. Heck, thanks for joining me this year. I want you to keep joining me. I'll be here next Friday with a new episode. Join us on the internet because we're everywhere. Hey, that's kind of cool. Watch this. Everywhere. I didn't know I did that. I thought I just made that up. See you next week.